Italian Greyhound Breeding Challenges and Ethics Breeding dogs has always been a subject of debate, particularly when it comes to certain breeds that face unique challenges. In this video, we will focus on the breeding challenges and ethics surrounding Italian Greyhounds. As one of the oldest and most elegant dog breeds, Italian Greyhounds have specific considerations that responsible breeders must take into account to ensure the health and well-being of the breed. 1. The History of Italian Greyhounds Italian Greyhounds have a rich history that dates back over 2,000 years. They were originally bred as companion dogs for nobility in ancient Rome, prized for their grace, beauty, and affectionate nature. However, their lineage has faced numerous challenges throughout history due to their small size, making the breed more susceptible to health issues. 2. Genetic Health Concerns one of the main challenges faced by Italian Greyhounds is their predisposition to certain genetic health issues. These include dental problems, patella luxation, eye diseases, and a variety of skin conditions. Responsible breeders must prioritize the health of their dogs by conducting thorough health screenings for breeding dogs, including genetic testing, regular veterinary checkups, and responsible breeding practices to minimize the risk of passing on these genetic conditions to future generations. 3. Ethical Breeding Practices Ethics play a crucial role in responsible dog breeding. Breeders must prioritize the welfare of the dogs over profit, ensuring that breeding dogs are not overbred and given proper rest between litters. They must provide a nurturing and caring environment for their dogs, including appropriate nutrition, socialization, and physical exercise. Breeders should also prioritize finding suitable homes for their puppies and educate potential owners about the breed's specific needs and potential health issues. For responsible breeding organizations, to further ensure ethical breeding practices, responsible breeders are often affiliated with reputable breeding organizations. These organizations set guidelines and standards that breeders must adhere to, including health testing, breeding age limits, and conformation standards. The International Canine Kennel Club ICKC, and the American Kennel Club AKC, are examples of organizations that provide recognition and support to responsible breeders of Italian Greyhounds. 5. Educating Potential Owners An essential aspect of ethical breeding is educating potential owners about the breed, its needs, and its potential health issues. Italian greyhounds require a specific level of care, including regular exercise, appropriate feeding, and frequent dental care. Potential owners should be aware of the breed's sensitive nature and vulnerability to certain environmental factors, such as extreme temperatures, Additionally, responsible breeders should provide ongoing support and guidance to new owners, ensuring the well-being of their puppies throughout their lives. 6. The Importance of Adoption While responsible breeding is essential for maintaining the health and integrity of the Italian Greyhound breed, it is equally important to promote adoption and rescue. Many Italian Greyhounds are in need of forever homes due to changes in their owner's circumstances or unfortunate circumstances such as abandonment. Shelters and rescue organizations play a vital role in finding these dogs loving homes. Potential dog owners should consider adopting before purchasing from a breeder to help reduce the number of dogs in need of homes. Conclusion Breeding Italian Greyhounds comes with its own set of challenges and ethical considerations. Responsible breeders prioritize the health and well-being of their dogs by conducting thorough health screenings, following breeding organization standards, and educating potential owners. However, adoption and rescue should also be promoted to ensure that all Italian greyhounds have the chance to find a loving home. By balancing responsible breeding with adoption efforts, we can preserve the breed while also addressing the needs of the existing dogs in need.